connecting and checking MT84 operation. Connecting and checking MT84 operation. Step 1. Insert the nut into the hole in the side of the MT84 device and connect it to the Hager socket breaker. Step 2. Then insert the yellow mount from the bottom of the device and tighten the bolt for secure connection to the device. Step 3. Install the device on the DIN rail. Pull out the hole to lock the lever of the device. Fix it. After which we can connect the cables to the circuit breaker. Step 4. Fasten the lid. Turn the lock hole to its original position. Then turn on the device. The device has the possibility of remote control via dry contact terminals and a RS-485 connection. Auxiliary terminals are also installed in the device, which allow you to connect additional LED indicators for operational troubleshooting. The indicator below, labeled Fault Current, indicates a voltage and related shutdown. If the device shuts down due to overload or short circuit, this indicator will change color from white to red. If it is necessary to change the operation mode, press the mode button for 4 seconds, after which the device's operating mode will be changed. It is worth considering that the device remembers the last selected operating mode. To orient the operating modes, you can look at the table that is currently shown on the screen. Now we will check the operation of the device for various problems. First, we will create a voltage fault and restore the voltage to operating range to make sure that automatic switching is possible. If there are no problems in electricity, the device will automatically turn on and resume power supply. Mighty smart! We make electricity safer and smarter!